I'm not an atheist anymore because I don't look at the world that way anymore. I'm not a materialist anymore. I don't think the world's made out of matter. I think it's made out of what matters. It's made out of meaning. Look at it from, a, from the perspective of modern brain science. What we orient towards unconsciously, which means what captures our attention, is meaning and it captures our attention before we know what it is. The brain acts as if the world's made out of information or made out of meaning. Heidegger, for example, German philosopher, was convinced that the world was made out of meaning, essentially, and that people's primary interaction with being was interaction with meaning. That isn't what modern people think, because they're deeply materialistic. Hello. Reality does not exist until it is measured. This is true, the moon, if nothing is measuring it, if conscious awareness is not measuring it, it disappears. Now, this has been proven with a large number of particles, but it's also true from a psychological standpoint. Your belief structures, your instinctive drives, the things you associate value to, the things you hold meaningful, they, through your reticular activation system, grab your attention and you selectively pick and choose variables from there to reinforce your reality. This is also true. So then what does this mean? Instead of saying, I'm a failure, say, where can I improve? And from there, by flipping the script, you manifest reality differently. And through selectively picking and choosing different variables, by manifesting reality to yourself differently, you measure, you render, you create on a very physics and psychological level, on a tangible level, you create the reality you wish to experience. This is why optimism is more likely to help you succeed than negativity, but it's so hard, isn't it? To control your mind, to actually be positive in a world that perpetuates so much suffering, in a mind that inherently has a negativity bias that at one point in time helped us survive by constantly seeing threats, by constantly seeing the things that could kill us. We were able to prepare for those things. In this day and age though, in a day of prosperity, we create a lot of phantoms through this negativity bias. But this is true. You can change your reality on a very tangible level, on a physics level, on a psychological level, by flipping the script. How can I improve? You didn't fail. How can I improve? It is the glass half empty, half full. I can try again. How can I do better? You'll manifest reality differently. And with it, your whole world will change. Peace.